Hi, this is Candy from Candy's All Media Review, and this is my final thoughts on the Arcos 5 internet media tablet with Android, and whether you should buy it or not, or whether you should buy the iPod Touch or Zune HD. Um, let's go go over the good things about the Arcos 5 internet tablet. Uh, has a large screen. Look at this beautiful 4.8 screen. It's thin. It's lightweight. It's sleek. It has a beautiful. It's a fingerprint magnet, but it has a, a beautiful screen. Glossy back here. Um, it's not just a personal media player. It actually has Android operating system on it. It has uh, a lot of great apps. You can put the Google Marketplace on there. You have look at this. You have Gmail. You have Google Talk, Google Google Voice, Pandora, Shazam, where you can uh, find out what a song. You can play a song and it'll tag it and tell you what it is. Um, Last FM. You have t Twitter uh, applications. Um, it just look at this. You have all these applications and games. Google Listen. You can make phone calls with this, with the with the right type of software. Um, so with that, it's it's comparable to the iPod Touch. The iPod Touch still has the most applications, but the Android software is, is definitely catching up. But you can just see the the variety of applications that are available um, on the Arcos Five IT and. There's a, there's a lot of settings. You can go to File Manager, and which uh, I haven't seen. The iPod Touch 3G doesn't have a File Manager on it like this. This is like a miniature computer, and you can delete it and, and and copy things. Also, if you hit the home button, you can also scroll over, and it has Google Search, just like on the uh, iPod Touch 3G. Um, the browsing experience is very fast. Uh, the The browser is like a full size browser. It's 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 better than a Safari browser for the iPod Touch 3G, and definitely better than the browser on the Zune HD. Uh, the pages load up super fast because it has the processor for the Arcos 5 Internet tablet with Android is the fastest processor uh, on any personal media device in the world, I believe, at the moment. Uh, it's it's running up to 800 megahertz okay so it's extremely fast that gives it the edge over the iPod touch 3g and the Zune HD the Zune HD is primarily an mp3 player okay if you if you want music first and are not really concerned about applications and you just you want something small compact this is a lot larger than the Zune HD then you might want to go with the Zune HD. It's a great device. Uh, th this is like a miniature computer. It's like a netbook. It's like a like a little uh, computer. Okay, it has its own uh, OS. You know, the in the Android uh, plays music and web TV, web radio. You can buy and rent music. Um, so, if you want to do all this, those things, I would go with the Arcos 5. Now, the iPod Touch, you can rent and buy movies. You can look at uh, videos. Um, but it doesn't have the, uh, the web TV uh, choices that you can get with, with the Arcos 5. I mean, the Arcos 5 just dwarfs it. Uh, you can't, like, open up radio stations and, and, and movies and the iPod Touch... Uh, browser you, and the video podcasts yeah you, know, you have the whole iTunes section for the podcast which the uh, Arcos 5 IT does not have but you can still um, you can still get to the video and audio podcast and specifically on here there's different devices you have dog catcher to have podcasts and so forth so you have a lot of uh, you can still get to them just like you would on the iPod touch Click out of here. The screen is resistive. It's uh, not as uh, touch sensitive as the iPod Touch 3G or the Zune HD, but it's still beautiful. Um, so I would say if you're going for a fully featured 
device that can that can do so much. Oh my god, I mean, you'll never get bored. This thing will blow your mind with the sheer amount of things you can you can do with it. And so, if you want an MP3 player, go with the Zune HD. And it, and it also has some apps on it. If you you know want just applications and you want something really portable to carry around uh, and y you you like the Apple software now the Apple so software is restrictive uh, too restrictive for some this does not have the restrictions of Apple okay guys and girls uh, the I iPod touch is a great device but if, if you want something that just does practically everything except for flash now flash does is not included on the zune hd or the ipod touch 3g now for this it has limited flash there there is flash support you can play flash games on some sites you can download flash games to this device and put it in the flash folder you can uh, look at ebooks on here this is a great ebook you can you can look at this and you can look at ebooks this way um, let me go to the ebook reader here to show you specifically I click on that one and there you go Uh, this is. Uh, I know little kids are going to look at this. Uh, let me choose. Something. <laughs> let me choose something different to to look at. Um. But anyway, as you can use this as a, as an ebook reader, and it, it works perfectly, perfectly well. I click on that. This will not replace Kindle or the Sony ebook e reader, okay? But it works very well. You click up here and you can change it to um, day and night so the pages are easier to see and you have all sorts of settings. So this is really, really nice uh, for ebook reading, okay? Um, I believe you can use this in portrait. Or maybe not. Uh, but anyway, I'm, I'm going to click out of here. So if you're looking for ebook reader, a uh, great, beautiful screen, you can do that. You can also read ebooks with the iPod Touch 3G, but you have the smaller screen, okay? And you do have a Kindle app for the iPod Touch 3G, and as of right now, I don't believe that the Google Marketplaces or the other app stores have a, a, a Kindle application, but there's plenty of other ebook applications uh, you can read, uh, you can use rather. <laughs> um, the iPod Touch 3Gs has fantastic games on it, so if you're looking for games, uh, that's definitely one choice. The Zune HD has some great apps, but not a lot of games, very, very few. This, you have your choice of a lot of games and the uh, Google Marketplace. Uh, but the games um, are not as advanced. The, the, the iPod Touch 3G definitely has an advantage uh, over it, but again, it has a lot. You saw the Google Marketplace uh, uh, previously, my previous review, has a lot of stuff. You know what? This has got to be one of my favorite devices I've ever owned. For me, uh, I liked, I enjoy this better than the iPod Touch 3G and a Zune HD. has a lot of features. It's gorgeous. It's lightweight. I'm going to have to say I would definitely recommend this. You can. This is available on Amazon.com. It's available on Best Buy, Radio Shack. Um, 8GB, 16GB, 32GB flash version. Hard drive version is 160 to 500 uh, mine was $299. Uh, I would say buy it. It is amazing. It'll blow your mind with what this thing can do. Uh, I don't hesitate to recommend it, so pick it up now, boys and girls.